Greetings and salutations you guys and here and you're welcome to a new video. How's everyone doing today? Because we're all doing fantastic. I'm sorry it's like so dark, but um we are in the car and about to go inside. I actually got a really good parking, like literally princess parking. The doors are right in front of me. But we are here today at the Goodwill in Santa Ana. This is the flagship store and I always forget what like the street is, but it's the Goodwill Marketplace. If you uh Google or Google Maps or whatever, Goodwill Marketplace, Santa Ana, this will pop up. And uh, this is actually home to three different stores. There's the regular Goodwill, which is huge. This is the largest one here in Orange County. And then there's a computer work store attached. So they sell computers, TVs, electronics, and all that good stuff. And then there's also an outlet attached where they sell clothing and items by the pound. So it's really cool. You can literally spend the whole day here, but I'm really excited to take you guys into the store. But if you guys love these sorts of videos, thrifting, thrift hauls, vlogs, um, everything from like thrifting, like home decor and kitchenware to like designer handbags and restoring them and setting up your thrifted tablescapes this is the place for you um hit that little bell button so you're notified when new videos do go up i also do live sales every friday and saturday night at 10 p.m pacific standard time and um for the month of december i'm posting two videos a day monday through friday and saturday sunday we just have one video a day which is the live sales and yeah that is pretty much it but let's go inside and see what we can find i'll see you guys in there oh, Alright, let's check out the store. The store is massive, like I said. Ooh, look at this long poncho. Is this for sale? <laughs> but yeah, look at the store. It's massive. Right? It's like really large. Okay, let's see if we can find any bags. Um, they're usually pretty good about like separating the good bags though at the store. They have been trained well. <laughs> but, you know, you can still find some good stuff occasionally. I actually got my... Oh, I got a Dior bag here, actually. A Dior camera bag. I actually still have it. I feel like I couldn't part with it. It's like one of the ones that I have thrifted that I just have to keep. Because it's, it's such a good find. Um, but yeah, so. Still have that. So I'm just like channeling that energy again. Hopefully we'll find something here. Oh, actually, I actually did just find a Marc Jacobs here recently. And I did just get also like a really cute, um, what was it? It was, it wasn't a, was it a fossil? Fossil, I think it was a fossil bag here, which was really, really cute. And I was really excited to find it. So, did, still have found a couple good ones. You just gotta get lucky and just gotta keep going. Be persistent and you know, that pays off. Just like with anything. And then of course you can always just get lucky and just like go in randomly and find something amazing. Cause I still get photos from you guys that go thrifting around these areas and I only go here, I actually only go thrifting here in Orange County once a week now. I used to go a little bit more often, but yeah, just on Sundays, so. You guys are still finding some great stuff. A few weeks ago, someone found a Prada bag. Someone found a Balenciaga. So, you know what? It's still happening. And I'm happy because I'm looking really curious to see you guys. The alarm is going off, unfortunately, because we had a set of More clothing. It's huge. Orange County's largest. Goodwill. And then here's like the furniture home decor section, which is my favorite. So we're gonna go through here and see if we can find anything cool. Oh, they have one of these, like, two of these tree skirt things. Put these under the tree. There's that one. There's a middle one. Oh my gosh, Fisher Price. That brings me back. We used to have Fisher Price stuff when we were younger. I, we actually still have a table. <laughs> like, the table that my sister and I had when we were children, the boys have now. But these chairs are actually very nice. These are $60 each. Hot dog, and there's three of them. Look at those chairs. I think those are Studio Mickey, probably collaborations with Target. These are really cute, too. I really like these. I wonder if they fold. Oh, they do. <gasps> these are cute. These are also very nice. These are $40 each. There's two of those. We have these chairs right here. Rollers on them. Oh, look at that. 
mirror that looks like a window. Cute and gray. What else? A little um, microscope. Love that. Love a microscope. Brings me back to my <laughs> biology days. Um, pellet grill front shelf. Interesting. Got the large paintings. There's the computer work store. You can only go into it though if you go outside and around the store. So let's see. I'm looking for... These are cute. Like little um, pine cone ornaments. I'm looking for like vases and the Royal Limited Crystal. I'm looking for like pretty crystal vases for my aunt. She's looking for a couple for her house. And I wanted to get her some also for, like, one at least one for her um, office that she's getting built, which I'm very excited for. <gasps> this is a clochette. Oh, this is nice. Wait a minute, this is actually really cute. $4.99. Oh, there's two of them. <gasps> I feel like these are actually very expensive. I wonder if I can Google image them and search them up and see where they're from. There's a chance they might actually be from Pottery Barn or, like, West Elm or something. I found it, you guys. It's the gallery. Cute. I actually think I will pick these up. I like them. They're tall enough to put like a good sized plant inside too. Um, but I need a cart. I don't exactly know what these are, but they kind of look like... Oh no, you hang stuff with them. Or you hang them on the wall? I don't know. But, but they're interesting. I thought they were like glass slaves or something. <laughs> Uh, you can put a candle on them, I don't know. Threshold piece right there. Mm. We have some, oh, that rose um, wreath is pretty. I love the botanicals. Look at these. Very fall colored though. Oh, the blue head is kind of nice. I'm like feeling really lazy to grab a cart that's all the way in the front. So I'm just going to walk around and then if the, the cloche or clochette or I don't even know what they're called, cloche, is gone, then it's gone. I like this crystal box or glass box though. Oh, it looks like it's broken on that one side. Oh, what a shame. Hmm. These are pretty too. Pretty heavy as well. I'm trying to channel Tiffany's right now. I want to find something Tiffany's. I think that'd be so fun. I haven't found Tiffany's in a hot second. So, let's go. Oh, another cloche. A whole bunch of these glass little things like that. Oh, I like the base of this. That's kind of fun. Oh, it's broken though. Being broken is not fun. Uh, oh my gosh. No, that's not Tiffany's. It looks different. I do like that smoky glass though. But yeah, not Tiffany's, sadly. Why oh, did I get excited for a second? I was like, dun dun dun. It's cool too. It's like a pink glass. It's kind of fun. It's like a basket weave. Butterfly and flowers. The Russian standard vodka. This is pretty. Don't know who makes that, but it's pretty. Oh, this is pretty too. Woo! I like the shape of these glasses. They're like very kind of like organic, right? But they're kind of like, you know, they're a little, they have a cool shape. <laughs> what is this? Okay. Um, I'm like literally looking at everything because It's fun. Sub Arthur. Do we see anything? This little Christmas tree, that's cute. Oh 
my gosh. There's a polar bear mug. This is so cute. It's a Martha Stewart one. Why do I kind of want this? Do I need this? Like, I might need this. It's really cute. Does it have any chips in it? Uh, exclusively for Macy's. It's adorable. I don't think those are chips, are they? <laughs> so I'm crazy. I brought the cloches over. Then I, along the way, I found these really cute, like, Christmas tree things. I really like these tassel ones. They're from Target. These are $4.99 each. I don't really need them, but like I kind of do. They're so cute. And then these are flops, and I don't even know where these are from, but these don't even have any prices on them. So, and then this little like metal one is also pretty cute. I don't know what to do with my life because I do like these flop ones and I do like these castle ones. But I feel like I need like another size to like really set it off, you know? So, like if I did like a set like, of these, like that's cute. They're all like different. Also, I just saw this thing, and I don't know why I think this is so cool. Oh, oh geez Louise, whoopsies. But look how cool this is. Let's put this right here. Like, this is kind of major. Um, there's another one over there, but it's missing the swinging thing. I don't know if it's just like misplaced. Oh, it's $9.99. Um, so cute though, right? So can you just imagine like two of these and then they're both facing inwards like this but I would probably get them if the other one had the hanging piece on it too but I don't think it does but I'm on the hunt for it. So if it doesn't have like the thing this is like perfect for hanging like a really cute like lantern like this but like one that like will fit because this is like too big i'm gonna like walk around the store and see if i can find the other piece and i just be like misplaced you know how that happens right you might have just like marked it as a separate piece hidden away somewhere but that is cute like it's even cute with just like this little christmas tree or you can put like obviously it's like for a candle or something but yeah it's kind of cool you can even put a handbag on there would be really cute. Hmm. Okay. Having too many ideas. This is also pretty. I love like glass like that. Like a smoky glass. This collection of like vases. These are kind of interesting. There's also this little blue one too. $1.99 This mug is kind of gorgeous It's stained inside but like the exterior Look at that The detail on it is kind of major Alright, I'm just like looking through this section but I don't think I really spot anything crazy Thresholds oh, How cute are these? Oh, these are Williams Sonoma They're like little shot glasses or espresso shot glasses, you know? Oh my gosh, you guys. I need to get this for my mom. Do you guys remember when I bought one of these for her and then I broke the lid? It was broken when we moved and she blamed me. She was so mad. Okay, I need to get this for her. She's gonna be so happy, but I'm gonna give it to her as part of her Christmas present. Her thrifted Christmas box because <laughs> she's gonna be so happy. Oh my gosh, that was so funny. I still can't believe it broke. That was like literally like one of the only things I broke when we moved. Which was so annoying. And I literally just got it right before we moved too. Also these plates are kind of pretty. Hello my inner grandma. She loves these. So cute right? Oh why do I kind of like these plates? Ugh. Oh no they're all taped together. Hold on let's like try to pull them out over here. And see if we can get to them. Look at that. I kind of like, I don't know the border is me. Um, uh, Libby. These look like Pottery Barn, but they're probably not mainstays. Ooh, polka dots. That's cute. Ooh, this is cute too. <gasps> look, these are cute. Ew, my inner grandma wants all these serving platters. 
but she won't have them. I'm being strong. Wait, what is this? <gasps> Ooh, English claw. Beautiful. These are kind of nice too. Oh no, look at all the nice clothes. Tunisia nights. Just dot dot dot. What are these? Uh, made in China, hand wash. Uh, where are these from? They look kind of anthropology esque. Just married? Oh, how sweet. Does anyone want these? Did anyone just get married? Ooh, look at this bowl. This is kind of cool. I love just like one off things. Like, this is so cool to me. Oh, look at that. Oh, this is nice. Too. What is this? Um, I can't even read what it says, but that's a cool bowl. <gasps> Ooh, ah, colors. <gasps> Am I in Tuscany? Perhaps Euro Ceramica. Those are pretty. Well, hold on, I wanted to see this coat down here. <gasps> Do you see that? Wow, look at that. Um, the English Pottery Company, designed in England. Look how pretty that plate is. Oh, to only have a set of eight of these, I would be so excited. I think they have these. Now I'm gonna look. What are these? These are nice too. Kang. Look at this dog. Um, easily distracted. What is this? Ooh. I feel like this print was like super popular back in the day. Wait you guys, I think I found it amongst the wreckage. Hold on, let us take a second to retrieve it. Is this it? Oh, it is it. <gasps> now do I have to buy it? <laughs> Hold on, let's just like reunite them together. Where are you? <gasps> there you are. Reunited and it feels so good. Reunited. Uh, 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 uh. Yeah, it's kind of cool, right? I feel like I need these. Whoa, how I miss these. Look at these chairs. They are pretty cool. Why is this candlestick holder like honestly kind of major? <laughs> Too bad there's only one. Oh my gosh, look at the furniture. Ooh, look at this little side table. Okay, there's this gold one, but like it's crooked. This one's in marble. Which is pretty cool. How much is that though? 50 buckaroos. Oh, uh, they got all the batteries. Alright, you guys, um, got my stuff inside the car, went around the corner, and here we are at Computer Works. So, let's go inside and check it out. Alright, we have a nest mini. These things are like, yeah, oh my gosh, Tom Toms. We have a bunch of Echo Dots. A uh, hum. Oh, I think that's a light bulb. We have a bunch of games. I'm gonna get these wireless headphones for the boys for Christmas. They're only 10 bucks each. Oh my gosh, we have just kind of brat TV. Oh, can we get the remote? Stop, why is there a Maybe it's not here. It is like, has like one little flaw right there, but it's not the worst. Hey guys, we are back at the house and I'm really excited. Oh gosh, dropping stuff. Really excited to show you guys what we ended up getting today um, at the Goodwill. I cannot believe what we found today though. I think the things that we found are fantastic. So let's get into it. Uh, first things first. I know this is so random too though. But I never thought I would be buying these at the thrift store, honestly. But here I am buying, like, energy meat slash, like, meal replacement bars <laughs> at the Goodwill. But we've made it to this point in our lives. Now I've really pretty much almost thrifted everything. Um, 
I think this might be my, like, like, they've, I bought food before at the thrift store, like, sometimes some thrift stores or Goodwills, like, they sell candy, sodas, or whatever. Sometimes I'm just, like, parched, or, like, just, like, I just need, like, a pick-me-up or something, so I'll, like, buy some of their really expensive candy and beverages. But, yeah, I didn't think I would be buying these, so... This, um, I, I'm familiar with the brand Atkins, uh, this is the Protein Meal Bar, Chocolate Chip Granola Bar, fantastic, 17 grams of protein, 3 grams of carbs, 200 calories, and then this one is the Chocolate Almond Caramel Bar, and I'll probably be giving most of these to mom, because she does love her, um, almonds and stuff like that. Um, ooh, made with real almond butter. I'll probably be keeping one for myself so I can try this. But, um, this one has 15 grams of protein. I don't even know why I'm reading you guys, like, the dietary information for these. But, 180 calories. And, um, uh, I don't know. I, we've, I've, I've been talking about my little, my, <laughs> my little weight loss journey that, um, I've been on for almost, yeah, for about past two months by the time you guys see this video. And... Uh, like, I feel like I like a good snack or whatever, especially, like, when I'm on the go, are these bars. Um, and they're meal replacement bars, but sometimes I'll just, like, eat half, at, like, earlier in the morning and later on I'll eat the other half. I think they're also good, kind of, like, uh, snacks as well. So just, like, as long as you don't eat, like, 50 of them, you know what I mean? Uh, so, I don't know. They're just, like, a good way to, like, kind of keep you on track for what you're eating, especially because I, I kind of like to, I like to eat, like, every few hours, you know, the whole keeping your metabolism going, and da 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 da, and all that stuff, and sometimes it's just, like, on the run, so these are just, like, great too, especially when I'm thrifting, and I don't want to, like, go get something, like, a fast, like, you know, can't eat fast food anymore, uh -huh. <laughs> and I, if, I don't want to, like, sit down and eat a salad, in the car. This is fantastic. And just like grab it on the go and just eat. So they had a bunch of these. I just got one of each. So we'll try it out. We'll see. Let me know if you guys have tried these though. Usually my favorite flavors, uh my favorite flavors, there's two of them. There's the birthday cake one is really good. And then there's another one which is like a pecan pecan one. I don't know it's like a pecan pr uh, something delicious it's so good so but we'll try these they'll probably be delicious as well so got those then okay this one i am so excited about because <laughs> this one I, I think i told you guys in the store this one i have like, a little bit of a funny story because i actually got one of these for mom right before we moved into this house and mom's always wanted one of these um it's kind of like you can put like pancakes in here or tortillas and it'll keep them warm and they have like the holes for like ventilation so they don't get soggy woggy and all that stuff uh, plus you can also microwave this too so it's fantastic you can do a lot with this um and when we moved i literally like i pretty much packed everything in the kitchen and of course i only i think i only broke two things without i packed and one of them was this, like, platter, which was kind of like the shape of, of a flower. But I actually had two of them. So one of them I still have. That one's still in good shape. But the other one, like, broke. And it was melamine, but it, like, shattered. Who would have known? Uh, then the other thing was the lid for this. So I still have the base of this. I literally still have it um, in my, um, like, in my cabinet thing. Um, it's missing the lid. And then I got another lid, um, that, like, I, I found at a thrift store. Just, like, randomly they were just selling a lid like this. But it doesn't actually fit on it. So, now I actually have the thing. So, I'm very, very excited. I'll probably just, like, end up donating the base or something. Maybe someone just needs the base. Or you can just use the base for, like, regular food, you know? But I, I got a replacement. I'm very excited. This was $5.99. Um... Very happy. I even remember where I bought the other one from. I bought it from my local thrift store. The one is like closest to me. That's where I got it from. And I remember I was so excited. I was like, Mom, look what I found. She's like, oh my god, I've always wanted one. We literally only used it once. <laughs> so, uh, but now I got you, Mom. We're back. I'm so excited. Uh, I'm verklempt. I'm like crying. Okay, then last but not least. Well, actually, there's a couple things. So, uh... And I've talked about this 
um, throughout, like, since I've been talking about this since November, but I'm really into thrifting presents, especially during Christmas time. I love it. I'm doing curated, I call it thrift miss boxes for members of my family and, like, my friends and stuff like that. And I'm actually going to be showing you the contents of a few of them uh, in an upcoming video. I need to figure it out still. But I have been looking for things for the kids because all they really care about at, like, right now, they're, like, games, iPads, whatever. And, um... Zach recently broke his i his headphones, and Eliza's never had headphones, and then, well, Cade still has his, but um, yeah, <laughs> but I found these. I think they're gonna die when they get these because these are pretty cool. I mean, I like never had such cool headphones when I was growing up, uh, but these are the Heyday wireless headphones. I got three of these. So this is part of their, like, little set of gifts. These were $10 each. And I literally, like, I was actually just going to buy them the Apple wired headphones. Because they just usually just play on their iPad. And they can just, like, you know, plug that in and play. But I think these will just be fun. Um, hopefully they don't lose them. I, but I think they'll take care of them. This will teach them responsibility. Maybe, you know, it'll be fun. $10 each. Um, I think it's good, right? $10 for cordless headphones. I think it's fantastic. They're all the same color. They can't fight over them. Um, we'll probably just have to, like, write the names on, like, <laughs> or, like, maybe have my sister, like, use some nail polish to, like, put, like, a dot of, like, a certain color for each one so that they know which one's which. And... Yeah, you know, we'll, we'll figure out a way to differentiate them when the time comes. But this is, I yeah, I was pretty excited about this, right? Like, $10. I was gonna, like, like I said, I was gonna buy the wired headphones. They were, like, $10, or no, $15 or $20. $20 at Target. And I think they were having a sale on Amazon, but I'm not sure if they're still on sale, but they were at $15 at one point. I'm gonna stop talking about that, but... <laughs> Wireless headphones, I think that's exciting. It's exciting, it's exciting, it's exciting. Okay, but this one is like the craziest thing that I ended up getting. And, um, I thought this would just be so cool. Like, the kids, I don't know, like, I think they'll have a, like, such a fun thing, like, time with these. And Cade recently just got a cell phone for his 13th birthday. Um, and he is just, like, so excited about it. And I saw this at the Goodwill. It's not a phone. It's not a phone. Um, but it's an iPod Touch. And I didn't even know they made these anymore, but apparently they still do. And this is actually a Target return item. So, or it was like a display or something like that. But it's like literally like still like brand new. Um, it came with everything. Um, I'm just gonna like take off the tape, clean it up, and then... Um, that'll be his present for me. And I'm like, it, it, it was $125. His birthday is in April. And I'm going to be like, well, Zach, this is for both your Christmas present and your birthday present. Though I'm, I'm sure I'm still going to find him to like, get him something else for his birthday. But like, just like, just like, you know, justify spending like a good amount. But, um, Zach has... I don't know, he's, he's, he's like, you know, all, all three of them are really good. Um, Cade got his phone, um, and just, like, <laughs> we, did, like, mom and I ended up also getting one of these for Eliza, so, um, yeah. The, so, Zach and Eliza are both gonna get iPod Touches. I know, it's, like, much, but Eliza's birthday is literally, like, the second week of January, so it's also his birthday coming up, and we're like, this is Eliza's birthday and Christmas present, so it's both of their birthdays and Christmas presents, whatever, you know what I mean? But yeah, plus their iPads are pretty old, <laughs> and um, I feel like Zach's iPad is like on his last leg, so now he can just like play on this, I don't know. He also does play on the computer sometimes too, and... You know, they, you know, kids and their gadgets. Um, I remember when I got my first iPod, it was literally... 
like the or no I didn't have the original iPad but like you know back in the day when it had like the little wheel thing that you like scrolled with your finger and it literally only had like how many like I don't even think it had a gigabyte yet did it have a gigabyte or it had like 560 megabytes or I don't know you know do you remember those like I had one of those like back in the day and I was like oh my gosh like that was like literally the coolest thing and I've never actually had an iPod touch um yeah I didn't have the iPod touch I did have the actually the first iPhone that was fun like that iPhone was so I actually still have the original plan for the iPhone, my, um, me, my mom, does John have the app? Oh, no, I don't think John, I don't think John has it, because he didn't get a phone when we got it. Yeah, he was, like, still, like, did he? No. I think it's just mom and I. We still have, like, the original iPhone plan, and it's, like, the, unli it's, like, unlimited internet, um, for, like, how much was it, like, $20 or something? I don't know. It was something, like, it was a really good deal. I think it still is a good deal. The minute that it's not a good deal, though, I'm changing the plan. But, yeah, so, I need some water. <laughs> a lot of explaining. I don't know what I'm talking about anymore. But, yeah, I'm just, like, you know, I'm just happy I'll be able to, like, give him something like this, you know? Um, and, yeah, like, they're... You know, it's such good. They don't really ask for really anything. Like, I was like, what do you guys want for Christmas? And they're like, a $10, $10 Roblox gift card. And I'm like, oh, look at it cry. Like, <laughs> so, yeah, they're still getting the Roblox gift cards, though. <laughs> but they're also going to get iPod Touches. It's crazy. All their birthdays are, like, so, like, well, not really Zach's birthday too much. His birthday's in April. But, like, Cade's birthday, it's literally, like, two days before Christmas, and then Eliza's is, like, two weeks after, and then, yeah, I don't know. Do I really need a reason to spoil them? I'm their uncle. I can do whatever I want <laughs> with, my, <laughs> with the money I spent on them, right? But, I don't know. I just love that I was able to get this at the thrift store. Um, albeit, like, a new one is, like, $199, so I didn't really save that much, but um, I did like that it kind of, like, gave us the idea about this. Plus, um, yeah. What a boot. <laughs> I don't think I've, like, I never got, like, an iPod thing with, like, cordless. Like, imagine, like, if I was a kid getting this, like, I am just, like, imagine, like, if I was, like, their age getting something like this, like, how excited I would be, and that's just, like, it's just, like, hyping me up even more, because I know that they're really, really, really gonna like it. So, yeah. I love it. <laughs> Uh, I just want to be able to spoil my nephews, you know? Especially with stuff from the thrift. I mean, fantastic. What, what can't you find at the thrift store? Like, honestly. Like, what have I not bought yet? I bought everything from home goods, clothing, shoes, handbags. Um, I've bought hair products. I bought skincare products. I've bought nail polish. Food. Diet food. Oh, I bought baking flour. They had flour at the Goodwill. Uh, they had, like, um, almond flour, and it was really cheap. And it was, like, that fancy almond flour. And I got a bunch of that for Mom because she's, she was going to make macaroons that she never made, and now I'm on a diet. So I'm like, well, don't make the macaroons. Actually, no. She can make the macaroons. Just, like, not the filling. Like, I'll just eat, like, the cookie portion because almond flour is actually... It doesn't ha It's not high in carb because it's made out of a legume. And... Okay, yeah, she can make that. She should make that. But I feel like every time she tries to make uh, macaroons in the winter, they, like, don't rise properly, but it's probably because it's, like, so cold or something. Like, it just, like, messes with, you know, the baking. Anyway, uh, what am I talking about? I'm, like... I'm, like, the president of going off on a tangent, so I don't even know where I was going with the story anymore, but that is today's thrift haul. I hope you guys had fun. I'm sorry I'm so chatty. I know someone's gonna be like, you talk too much. Just show us what you got and be done. But I'm sorry. I love you guys so much, though, and I love chatting with you all, and don't forget to tune in to Fridays and Saturdays, where I'm sure I'll talk your ears off, and someone will probably say I talk too much. Um... <laughs> 
<laughs> but tune into the live sales Friday and Saturday nights. I mean, this week it, it's not going to happen because it's Christmas Eve and Christmas Day. But um, shortly after, um, I'll be making them up probably like on a Sunday or sometime during the week or something. Because uh, I do have some pretty cool stuff for you guys. You might see some of it behind me. I've been filming hauls all night. It's literally, what time is it? I don't know why I do this to myself. It's like 12.09. Um, and that is a.m., not p.m. So, uh, that's the end of the video. I love you guys so much. I'll see you guys on the next one. Adios!